Welcome to another edition of Fix 64. I'm Darren Hadley and today we are looking at the Minis Forum Elite Mini UM890 Pro. And this unit has an AMD Ryzen 9 8945HS processor. And let's see, integrated GPU is an AMD Radeon 780M. And this one does not have any memory, storage, anything. It's just a bare bone unit. So I will be doing a quick how to video today on how to install the RAM and the NVMe drive. And also this Oculink port that goes into the other NVMe slot inside the machine. So. This ought to be fun. Um, I'm going to get it and we shall start. All right, here it is. It's kind of about the size of a Mac Mini and really small. Got a couple of USB 3 ports up here, a USB 4 audio jack and a reset switch, and of course the power switch. Um, side ventilation. The back. A couple more USB. Display port, USB 4, HDMI, 2.5 gigabyte LAN. Two of those. And of course where your power adapter goes. And a blank Oculink port, and we will be installing that Oculink port. Okay, let's crack this thing open. First off, all you have to do is lift up on some of the lips and it the top comes right off, it's magnetic. And then there's four screws in each corner. Now when you're taking this part off, make sure you don't, you know, yank it because there is uh, Wi-Fi and Bluetooth antennas. one okay all right now that it's unscrewed we can take the top off very carefully and just kind of Put it towards the rear of the machine. Just kind of stand it up. There's another little cable right there. Okay. First off, let's throw the RAM in. Okay, that's in. Okay, I got some more light. That'll help. Um, 
All right, next thing is the Oculink port. And that's what you will hook an external GPU up to to make the system perform better if you're into gaming or whatever. So I just slip it in this one and make sure the cables are underneath. And I will just put the screw back in. It's just like installing an NVMe drive if you've ever done that before. Okay, that's in. And then our two terabyte drive. Boom. That's pretty much all we have to do on this thing. Now we got a powerful little mini PC. Put these back down. Make sure the holes are lining up okay. Oh yeah, I want to check that Oculink port too. Yep, looks fine. It's now installed. And now we simply put the screws back in. But yeah, these uh, systems, they either come pre-configured with uh, RAM and NVMe and all that, or you can just get these bare bones, and as you can see, you might be able to save some money. It's fairly easy to get into them and upgrade, or just plain make them work. Okay. Got all the screws in and boom, we are done. Now we have 32 gigs of RAM, two terabytes, and an Oculink port. And now we can do some kick ass gaming with it. All right, well, that's all I have for you today. Thank you for subscribing. Um, if you like what you saw, please subscribe and click the uh, thumbs up, and I will see you all next time. Thank you.